Hey there, welcome to Terrific 10. You know, dinosaurs get all the fame, but there were so many other cool creatures that don't exist anymore. Sorry T-Rex, you're not on this list, but don't worry, you're still terrifying. Now, let's get started with our top 10 extinct animals we wish we could meet. At number 10 we have the giant ground sloth. This isn't your garden variety sloth hanging out in a tree. These were elephant-sized behemoths, and probably as slow as watching paint dry. You know what they say, the bigger they are, the slower they move. Or something like that. Coming in at number 9, we have the moa. These flightless birds from New Zealand make your Thanksgiving turkey look like a pigeon. But don't get too excited, they weren't big on cuddling. Number 8 is the saber-toothed tiger. This one needs no introduction. The poster child for things you wouldn't want to meet in a dark alley. Or a brightly lit one for that matter. If you think getting a nibble from your house cat is bad, just imagine what these guys could do. Swooping in at number 7 is the Great Auk. Don't let the name fool you, there was nothing awkward about this bird. Except maybe its inability to fly. And its extinction. Okay, so it was a little awkward. Our number 6 is the Stellar Sea Cow. Yes, you heard that right. Sea Cow. Like a cow, but in the sea. This giant relative of the manatee was a gentle giant of the Arctic, chilling in the cold waters. Too bad chilling doesn't involve a time machine, or we'd all be having sea cow spotting vacations right now. Number 5 is the Irish Elk. And no, it wasn't particularly fond of Guinness. Known for its enormous antlers, this majestic creature was more like a giant deer than your typical elk. Its antlers could span up to 12 feet. Talk about a head turner. Coming in at number 4 is the Quagga. If you can't decide whether you like zebras or horses more, the quagga was your guy, half horse, half zebra, and 100% extinct. Its unique appearance was definitely something to marvel at. And if you're wondering, it's pronounced, K-W-A-H-G-H-A. -H -H -A. Try saying that three times fast. Taking bronze at number three is the Tasmanian tiger. Despite the name, it wasn't really a tiger, but a marsupial. Its jaw could open wider than a surprised snake, and it carried its young in a pouch. We're not entirely sure if it roared or just made disgruntled kangaroo noises, but we wish we could find out. Silver goes to our number two, the dodo. Poor old dodo was a flightless bird living the island life in Mauritius. Maybe it was too relaxed, too chill because it didn't survive the arrival of hungry sailors and invasive species. It's now famously known for its rapid extinction and is a poster child for gone and definitely forgotten. Finally, at number one, the king of lost potential friendships, the passenger pigeon. Once one of the most populous birds in North America, their flocks were so huge that they would block out the sun. It's said that when they flew by, you'd have to check your sundial. Unfortunately, intense hunting and habitat destruction led to their extinction. One minute it's sunny, next minute it's raining passenger pigeons, and then, nothing. How's that for a change in the weather? And there you have it, folks. Our top 10 extinct animals we wish we could meet. Remember to hit the like button if you enjoyed the video and don't forget to subscribe to Terrific 10 for more mind-boggling top 10 lists. And always remember, extinction is forever, so let's take better care of the critters we still have around.